All right, we are going to give this a shot today. Uh, we are going to do a little pattern work at the Centennial Airport, uh, KAPA. It's in uh, Centennial, Colorado, near Denver, Colorado. Uh, and we are going to just fly a little pattern work this morning or this evening um, using Pilot Edge. Uh, it's been a little while since I've used Pilot Edge, so I thought I'd give that a try tonight. I've got a brand new set. Tower, good here. evening. Walker 380, hold the short uh, uh, sim 2020 and OBS bringing in my iPad for full flight. Walker 380, Reno Tower, runway 16 left, clear for takeoff. And we're going to get ready. Runway 16 left, clear for takeoff, Walker 380. We're going to get ready to call up, um, call up ground here and request, request pattern work and taxi. Uh, I've already got the ATIS here. Uh, ATIS information is Romeo. Air Transport 913, shorter runway 31 for IFR departure. Request uh, RNAV Zulu to 31 from Hoggett. Air Transport 913, Amarillo Tower, wind 31016, runway 31, clear for takeoff, and uh, uh, have your request. Cliff to go for runway 31, air transport 913. Good evening, uh, Centennial Ground. This is Cessna 716 Delta Mike requesting pat pattern work and taxi with information Romeo, currently parked in the Alpha Ramp. 716 Delta Mike, Centennial Ground, runway 17 left, taxi the Alpha. 17 left, taxi via Alpha 716 Delta Mike. So it's a 658, contact port 1 to approach 124.35. All right, so we're going to taxi uh, via Alpha, runway 17 left. We'll hold short there. We'll give Tower a call, let them know we're ready for departure. Uh, and we will do close, close traffic. So here we go, we'll switch over to the map right now. And let's give this a whirl. For 61658, port wind approach. Port wind approach, Cessna 61658, 4600 level. Around us. 61658, port wind approach, thank you, port wind altimeter 30165, JF uniform. 3016, and uh, air traffic, uh, here we have not gotten the weather yet. Uh, do you see traffic on, at my 12 o'clock, by the way? There's 61658, I don't see any traffic at your 12, well, disregard. I uh, do see traffic slightly left of your 12 o'clock, about six and a half miles, uh, opposite direction, altitude one uh, 1,900. Additional traffic just off your uh, like seven to eight o'clock, half a mile, uh, same direction. I'll just think it's two thousand one hundred. Appears to be climbing. Both uh, types run now. All right, we've got an eye on the traffic in front of us, and we see that they're below us. The traffic to our seven o'clock, we don't have quite yet. Air six five eight, Roger. They're both uh, like more than 3,000 feet below you. I'll let you, uh, crash I'll keep you advised if I see them climb. Uh, we've got the traffic inside. They're, they're below us. They're just off the wing behind us. 61658. Roger. Air Transport 913, contact departure. Departure, Air Transport 913. Walker 380, contact departure. Departure, Walker 380. Okay, so we're there. We need tower on 118.9. So let's go ahead and... Air Reload Departure, Air Transport 913, 5,700, climbing 9,000, runway heading. Air Transport 913, Amarillo Departure, radar contact. Understand you look for the RNF Zulu uh, runway 31 approach from Hoggett. Affirmative, Air Transport 913. Air 
Transport and Air Transport 913, when able, clear direct Hoggett, cross Hoggett at 6,100 or above, cleared RNAV Zulu, runway 31 approach. Since we're a little behind. Cross Hoggett at or above 6,100, clear for the RNAV Zulu, runway 31, Air Transport 913. Since it's getting late, I've been screwing with Pilot Edge for a little while. Monterey clearance, walking tree 06, IFR to Santa Monica. We are going to skip the run up. Walk here, 306, Monterey clearance, turn by. Climbing 9,500 via set. Walker 380, North Carolina departure, radar contact. Walker 306, Clear Santa Monica Airport, Monterey 5 departure, Shuey as filed. Uh, maintain 7,000, expect flight level 21010 minutes after departure. Departure frequency 121.3, squawk 7326. Clear to the Santa Monica Airport, Monterey 5, departure Shuey, then I filed, climb maintain 7,000, expect flight level 2101 minutes after, departures 121.3, squawk 7326, Somebody Walker 306. Walker 306, three, five, correct. Centennial Tower, Cessna 716, Delta Mike, holding short, runway 17 left. For 716 Delta Mike, uh, Centennial Tower, left cliff traffic approved to report missile each time. Runway 17 left, clear for takeoff. Runway 17 left, clear for takeoff, left close traffic. 716 Delta Mike. Alright, so we are clear for takeoff. Approaching runway 17 left. I'm going to do left traffic on 17 left. Air Transport 913, report turn it up. Remaining. Report, Air Transport 913. down in the one notch. I'm pretty excited about this, actually getting to record this on OBS for the first time uh, with Pilot Edge and Microsoft Flight 720. All right, there's 60, let's rotate. And we're up. Look here at at the plate. Pull up my information. Portland Center, here. Cessna six one six five eight. Would love to get the weather over at Portland and come back to you. Sixty eight eighty five. Six five eight. Roger. Let me know when you're back on frequency, please. Sounds good. Six one six five eight. Monterey ground. Walker tree zero six with uniform at the Del Monte FBO. Ready for taxi. Walker 306, Monterey ground, runway 28 left, taxi via Alpha. 28 left, taxi via Alpha, Walker 306. Alright, so we're coming up on 6300. I'll we'll go ahead and turn our left crosswind here. Approach this in a 61658 back with you with uniform. Air 658, thank you. Go ahead and turn her downwind. Air 6 Delta Mike, runway 17 left, clear for the option. Clear for the option, runway 17 left, 716 Delta Mike. Alright, we are clear for the option. Air Transport 913, turn at this. Air Transport 913, BQ, contact Amarillo Tower. Tower, Transport 913. Did I say that altitude was? 68 and 85, so 6900 coming up on it. Amarillo Tower, Transport 913, Arnav, Zulu 31. 
Pictures for 913 Amarillo Tower. How will this uh, approach terminate? We'd like to plan for the uh, full procedure, Minister Transport 913. Air Transport 913, Roger. Runway 31, go to land, report the mist. Go to land, runway 31, report the mist. Air Transport 913. Pull the power back a little bit. Try to trim our nose down some. Look out of our left here. We're just up at beam the numbers. So I'm going to do this like I work uh, with my current trainer. I am working with the CFI to get my PPL. So we can pull the power back, hold the nose up a little bit, get into the arc here. We'll add the first notch of flaps there. And we'll go ahead and turn our base. There's base. 7 left. We still got a little ways to go. Go ahead and bring in that first, that next notch of flaps. Watch our airspeed. Get ready to go ahead and turn final. Oops, turned it a little early. Fix that on the next go around. Just a little bit on the next go by. Drop our next notch of flaps. Airspeed's a little low. Let's go ahead. I'm going to make the runway now. Pull the power back. Report Portland Airport in sight. 5-8's got Portland in sight. Alright, we'll go back around. Under 6 5 thank you. Contact Portland Tower. Contact Portland Tower, thanks so much. 5-8. Okay. Walker 380, uh, the top altitude on the departure, I believe, fly level 190, uh, so you shouldn't climb above that. Uh, contact Oakland Center 127.45, so could try. Which is if I may, I thought uh, going to the Blackjack with this flight level 190, not towards Pesky. Okay, 380, the, uh, the top altitude for the SID itself, like all transitions, is flight level 190. And uh, you just wait for ATC to give you higher. Uh, if you if you get to flat level one hundred zero and you have not received a higher altitude, you, you have to level off. Oh, I blew that one. Okay, should I go climb or go ahead level off? Air traffic controller is busy. Uh, Walker three eighty uh, maintain flight level two four zero. Go ahead and contact Oakland Center one two seven point four five. Twenty seven forty five and two four zero. Sorry about that. Thank you, Walker three eighty. Portland Tower assistant six one six five eight inbound. She is super. Three six one six five eight Portland Tower. Uh, report midfield left downwind runway one zero left. We'll report midfield downwind for one zero left. Gotta whip that one around. Air transport nine thirteen looks like you're on the missed contact uh, approach one one nine point five. One one nine point five. Air transport nine thirteen. Monterey Tower. Three zero six five five. Runway one seven left. Clear for the option. 7 left, clear for the option. 716 Delta Mike. It is quite fun. Okay, 380 Oakland Center, climb and maintain flight level 310. Definitely brought this line. We're, we're definitely in a lot tighter this time, so that'll probably help that I was a little early. Portland Tower 61658, question for you when you have a chance. Stand by. Transport 913, Amarillo approach to our radar contacts and intentions. Air Transport 913, we'd like to hold at uh, 10,000 as published. Air Transport 913. So here we are, midfield. 
Well, that's how this climb maintain one zero ten thousand. Expect further at zero two four zero. Time now zero two two zero. Transport nine thirteen. Clean that pattern up a little bit. We did some drifting. Monterey there. Tower, I think I stepped over you. Walker three zero six ready for I four departure two eight left. Walker three zero six Monterey Tower runway two eight left. Clear for takeoff. Phone call. Clear for takeoff runway two eight left. Walker three zero six. Three six five eight. Go ahead and turn. Uh, so when approaching from Monterey Tower, uh, Monterey Tower runway two eight left. Clear for takeoff. Phone call. Clear for takeoff runway two eight left. Clear and contact, contacting a tower, is it helpful to say the direction of flight, or is it assumed you already know that because you've been handed off and I've, I've been handed off and I've got a squawk code? Uh, Nurse 61658, uh, given that you do have a squawk code, it means we are tracking you on radar. So um, it's not a bad habit to go ahead and say your position in relationship to the airport just to get in the habit of it as a um, confirmation of what we're seeing on radar. That way if it's uh, if there's a discrepancy, then we can confirm it, or maybe we're looking at the wrong wrong aircraft. Good to know. Thanks so much. I'm glad I asked. Six one six five eight. So as you can tell, no problem. Well, Nor six five eight. Happy right now. We're on my one zero left. Clear to land. Heard this guy. So one zero left. Clear to land. Six one six five eight. Good quality feedback. Um, final runway one seven left. All right, here we are on final. A lot smoother or better approach this time than we were last time as we turn final. Like I said, I'll clean that up a little bit. It's been a while since I've actually flown the pattern here at uh, Centennial. I picked Centennial. It's kind of unique for me because uh, I live in the Midwest and I work and travel quite a bit out to the Denver area and I have an office, the company I work for has an office there in Centennial and I actually do a lot of work with aircraft when it comes to work. And I actually uh, been to this airport many a time Nice smooth landing there. Very good, very good. All right, flaps up a notch, power forward. Let's do this again. Let's go around, do it again. Pretty smooth, much better. I think we can do a little better on this next go. Put flaps at 10. Wait for 60 and then we'll rotate. I think we can rotate probably at 55. We'll go ahead. Rotate at 60, there we are. While we're climbing out here, I'm going to zoom out on fourth flight just a little bit, take a look at my pattern there. Yep, definitely could clean that up, be more consistent. Sorry, I was pulling back there as I was looking over at fourth flight. Bring all of our flaps out here, we'll continue our climb. Fly runway heading until we get to 6300, and we plan to make a left crosswind there on our crosswind leg there for a short piece and then we'll turn on our downwind leg. But what you can see here is the interstate there and that's usually Walker 306 contact departure. The time I'm ready to turn crosswind or to departure Walker 306. I'm at 6, and I am. So we'll go ahead and turn our crosswind here. That circular building right there, interestingly enough. Norco uh, departure Walker 306 4.2 climbing 7000. Just in the uh, market buying a Walker 306, North Cat departure, radar contact reaching 5,000, clear track Salinas, climb and maintain flight level 190. That particular office building. Climb and maintain flight level 190 uh, and reaching 5,000, clear really direct, to direct Salinas, Walker 306. Uh, hours that be decided on a different or a different facility, so that is not the one that I will be working in, but it's going to be real, but we're still going to be really close to the airport. We have a couple of hangars here at this airport um, with the company I work for and what we do. All right, so we're on our downwind leg. Not hurt, tower, you call. Keep climbing for a minute, report to midfield. For 658, exit right when able and taxi to parking via Alpha. Monitor ground, have a wonderful evening. Thanks so much, Will. Taxi via Alpha and X. Exiting right now at Alpha Alpha. Uh, we'll transfer the ground. Thanks so much. Six Delta Mike, runway one seven left. Clear for the option. Seven one six Delta Mike. 
clear for the option runway 17 left and once it's done flying. Still drifting a little bit to the left. There's our 6900. We'll push the nose down now, pull some power. Get her leveled out here. there and right at the numbers. So we're going to go ahead and pull the power now. Right at, so I'll go ahead and pull one notch of flaps in. Get ready to burn our base here. base leg. Pitching for about 65-70 right now. Probably aiming closer to 70 if I can get the nose down a little bit. Go ahead and bring in my next notch of flaps. That should keep us down at the 65 area. Get ready here to turn our final. Final is clear. Here we go, we'll turn final. Nice. Definitely lined up on that one much better. Bring in our last notch of flaps. And see if we can't set her down here on the runway. Nice and steady. Touch of power. Touch of power. out, runway's made, transition her eyes down the runway, pull her back, hold her off, hold her off, hold her off, there's the stall horn, and we're down, probably didn't get that quite as good and smooth as I'd like, I'd like to have that stall horn going off right as our wheels are touching and thus not dropping, but it wasn't bad, alright, flaps for 10, power's full, Try to hold center line here. Approaching 60. And rotate. We're off. I find that every time I switch to that outside view like that, that the nose dry, even without me moving, yoke or our joystick here. If I switch to that D, you watch the nose dive every single time. It's quite interesting. Go ahead and bring those flaps up. Aurora approach, air transport 913. Uh, completing this turn in the hole, we'd like hog it again for the uh, RNAV Zulu 3-1. Air transport 913, roger. Uh, when able to clear direct hog it, cross hog it at uh, 6100 or above. Cleared RNS, the runway 3 1 approach, Amarillo altimeter 2988. Romeo is now current. 2988, cross hog it at above 6100, clear for the RNS, Zulu runway 3 1, and uh, we'll get the new weather. Air transport 913. We can extend this crosswind leg just a little bit so we can clean up that. contact Denver Center, 133.67. Okay, here we go. We'll Walker 306, contact Oakland Center, 128.7. 128.7, Walker 306. Okay, there we go. Zero zero Lima Delta, contact Albuquerque Center, 128.45. Climb going. Okay, 306 Oakland Center, climb and maintain flight level 210. Okay, we're getting there. We have not reported our bid. 
downwind leg yet. The three winds are Lima Delta, Albuquerque Center, thank you. Winds low altimeter, 3012. Delta 184, Denver Center, 133.67. Centennial Tower, Cessna 716 Delta Mike, reporting midfield left downwind, runway 17 left. Air 6 Delta Mike, runway 17 left, clear for the option. Clear for the option, 17 left, 716 Delta Mike. Alright, we'll go ahead and pull the power here. She's busy. First notch of Delta 2084, Denver Center, I think you descend via Flatty 1 arrival. base leg. You can see consistently that road right there below us. Um, we're hitting that just about every single time on our base leg turn. Which is good. Get our visual landmarks in. Airspeed's a little slow. Got the nose up a little too much. Want her back down, get some speed. Bring in that next notch of flaps. Just a little bit longer here before we turn final. All right, there we go. And here comes our final. Very good, very good, Short very good. Final runway one seven left. Just a touch of power. Put our nose down a little bit. Our last notch of flaps. Push Transport 913 Biff. Go ahead and pull the power. Air Transport 913, thank you. Contact Amarillo Tower. Air Transport 913. Amarillo Tower, Transport 913. Pilots, air correction, Arnaz Zulu, runway 31. Down the runway. Air Transport 913, Amarillo Tower, uh, same tension. Very nice. We'd like another right missed approach to a full procedure, full procedure hold there, Transport 913. Transport 913, Roger, runway 31, clear to land, report the mist. Clear to land, runway 31, report the mist here, Transport 913. Okay, there's 60, rotate. Looking good, looking good. Pattern's getting a little better. Let's see what we can do to improve on it this time. This is a pretty fun exercise. It's a lot of fun in the real world, too. Uh, I have been uh, currently started in the last of August, so this is uh, now October, so all of September, so four, six, about seven weeks, seven, eight weeks now, uh, working toward my PPL. Uh, I'm learning to fly the uh, Satabria is the tail dragger uh, and I might say that it has been one of the most fun things I've ever done uh, a great big challenge so like clearance Mooney 32 hotel radio I check to actually fly the 172 in real life other than Clear radio check your five five. a few years back with the thank you. who took me up he let me take the controls there for a few minutes but uh, learning to fly tail dragger and do the rudder dance is it's quite a thing to learn, uh, and it's quite exhilarating. Uh, if you ever get the chance to, to learn at a tail dragger, I would say I recommend it. Um, I was uncertain. My CFI uh, assured me that if I learned to fly the tail dragger, that it would indeed make me a better pilot. So I agreed to uh, let's do that, and I don't think I'll have any regrets. It's definitely a fun plane. Um, there's no flaps on that airplane. Uh, so you have to really learn pitch and control of airspeed. Uh, because unlike the Cessna, you can't just drop the flaps and hold your airspeed back. Air 6, Delta Mike, runway 17 left, clear for the option. Clear for the option, 17 left, 716 Delta Mike.
approaching our pattern altitude here. Under 100 feet to go. Alright, we're there, we'll push the nose down and pull some power. RPMs around 22, 2300. And we should be able to more or less let her plane herself off there. She's trimmed. Not perfectly, but pretty close. And we're looking for the numbers there. When we get a beam, the numbers. This is what we practice in the Satabria, my CFI. All right, here we go. We're beam the numbers. We'll go ahead and pull the power back. Air transport Both 913 on the miss. The wide arc. We'll go first notch of flaps. Air transport 913, thank you. Contact departure. And departure, air transport 913. Go ahead and turn our base leg. That's looking good. Good. Air speed is just above 70. Go ahead and bring that next notch of flaps in. Look to the right, clear final. Final looks clear. Runway is on our left, we're not ready Departure yet. transport 913, 5200, climbing 6200 on published mist. Okay, and here we go, we're gonna turn our final. Air transport 913, MRLO, approach your radar contact. Stay intention. Stay by one air transport 913. Just a touch of power. Air transport 913, are you able to get us the uh, ILS runway for a low approach? Runway is made, power is completely pulled. Line her up on center. Air transport 913, you want to take the uh, approach with the arc or just vectors to localizer? So if you get us a second to get set up, uh, we'll take it from the arc. I guess we'll go ahead and just establish and holding and call you when we're ready. There we go. Sounds good.
approach here, transport 913. We'd actually like to uh, get a right turn, direct panhandle, and uh, take the ILS from panhandle for runway 4. Uh, Air Transport 913, roger, turn right, direct panhandle, cross panhandle at 6,000 or above, cleared ILS, runway 4, approach, report inbound, uh, salvage low visor. Panhandle 6,000 or above, clear for the ILS, runway 4, old port inbound, Air Transport 913. Air Transport 913, are you planning a miss on this approach or are you looking for a circle for runway 31? Uh, we'll actually plan a uh, missed approach again, Air Transport 913. Uh, 36 Delta Mike, runway 17 left, clear for the option. Runway 17 left, clear for the option, 716 Delta Mike. She read my mind, I was getting ready to give her a call because I hadn't heard from her saying clear to land. Go ahead and take it. We're gonna bring in our second notch of flaps here. Final looks clear. Runway's to our left. We're almost ready to turn. There's our turn coming here. A little soon. Let's judge that just a little bit. Touch of power. Final runway 17 left. Touch of power will arrest our descent. Slow it just a little bit. Now we'll go ahead and pull the power back some more. Over the nose, bring in that last notch of flaps. Set her on the runway. Slide slope indicator there. Alright, go ahead and transition eyes down the runway. Hold her off, hold her off, hold her off. Boom, we're down. Might have got a little aggressive with that one. Let's see if we can clean that up just a little bit more on this next go around. Contact Denver Center 120.47. Okay, we're off. We're rotated. Walker 380, contact Los Angeles Center 133.2. Walker 306, contact Los Angeles Center 135.5. Delta 284, Denver Center, good evening, Denver Altimeter 3021, uh, landing north. That last notch flaps up. Okay. Here we come, 6300, there's our interstate. Go ahead and make our left crosswind here. Downwind now. Keep that nose up on the horizon. There we go. Come on. Get our altitude. Sixty-eight hundred, a little over a hundred to go. And there we are. There's our 
for 6900. Push our nose down, pull some power back. Let her get it trimmed. Midfield, there's the tower just off our left. Muzu LaGround, November 390 Delta Alpha. 390 Delta Alpha, Missoula Ground. 390 Delta Alpha, Premier One, looking to pick up our IFR to Haley. Three six Delta Micro, my one seven left, clear for the option. Clear for the option, one seven left, seven one six Delta Mike. Power. She's got her timing down pretty good. Hold the nose up. There's our arc. Bring in our first notch of flaps. We'll go ahead and turn our base. Premier 390 Delta Alpha, clear to Haley, Freedman Airport. Missoula 5, departure. Missoula 5, Delta Alpha, take my audio. Cut out there. Uh, Missoula 5 departure, Salmon transition, as filed. Climb via SID, expect level 2501 zero minutes after departure. And squawk 2360. Here we go. Let's go ahead and turn our final. 390 Delta Alpha cleared at Missoula 5 departure, Salmon transition, climb via the SID, expect 25. Zero, 10 minutes after departure, squawk 3360, and we missed the departure frequency for 390 Delta Alpha. 390 zero, zero Delta Alpha, the squawk is 2360, and uh, anytime you're uh, departing via a SID and the departure frequency is omitted from the clearance, uh, that usually means it is provided on the chart. Uh, if you need it, though, it's 124.9er. 124.9er, and I hadn't looked at the chart yet for 390 Delta Alpha. There's zero Delta Alpha, no worries. I expect no. runway uh, 1 2 for departure. Yep. We'll expect 1 2 390 Delta Alpha. We'll go one more. Southwest 2084, contact Denver approach 120.35. I'm having a pretty good time with this. 310 limit, Delta contact Phoenix approach 133.57. Take. So, I guess my next big thing here is Denver just to decide if I'm ready to go ahead and do something like this on live stream, uh, since I've got the recording set up here. And it seems to be 2084, right Denver approach, thanks for Sierra. Uh, visual approaches are in use. Do you have a runway preference? And I wonder what is a big like, like either uh, uh, 34 right or 35 left off of 2084. So, uh, learning experience for me. Positive rate, let's get that last notch of flaps up here. What a sunset. So this one eight four, I think uh, three five uh left will put you closer to your gate tech. Expect to put your three five left. Looks like the visual three five minus twenty eighty four, thanks. Okay, next approach, switch us three one zero Lima Delta, information November level one two thousand, like to request the uh, GPS from a two one flex out. Turn our crosswind. Three one zero Lima Delta, Phoenix approach, Flagstaff House number three zero one nine er. You said you do have a mic, and do you want to start the approach from Hedgerow? We have mic, and uh, yeah, Hedgerow would work. Three one zero Delta. Okay, go ahead and turn our downwind. Three one zero Lima Delta, clear direct Hedgerow, cross Hedgerow at one one thousand or above, cleared Arnav runway two one approach. Direct Hedgerow one one thousand or above, clear for the approach. Three one zero Lima Delta. Three six Delta Mike runway one seven left clear for the option. Runway one seven left clear for the option seven one six Delta Mike. Altitude. Good level of 
comes off a little power. Flaps coming in. Go ahead and turn our base. Second notch flaps coming in. Final looks clear. Runways to our left. We're not quite ready for our turn yet. Nose is down. Go ahead and turn final. Touch of power. Short final runway 17 left. Tucson Approach, good evening, this is Cessna November 106 Alpha Zulu, looking for flight following to Tucson, I'm currently two, mi two, two zero miles northeast uh, at flight level 550 with information Oscar. Sorry, you cut out just a little bit there. I got the 1273 and IDEN. What was the rest of your 06 Alpha Zulu? Your 06 Alpha Zulu is just uh, same main position, Tucson Approach. I'm going to call this was the last one coming here. There we are, 60, and we'll rotate. Good amount of patterns here. Looking at four flight over my shoulder here. Uh, looks like we were pretty consistent for the most part. Looks like we had two that were in a little tight. As you can probably tell, I tend to run a pretty tight pattern. Uh, so that's what my CFI has taught me. 106 Alpha Zulu radar contact 15 mile northwest of Tucson Airport, Tucson altimeter 3006. Maintain appropriate view for altitude. Maintaining appropriate VFR altitude. Thanks for the contact. 06 Alpha Zulu. Lights are coming on on the interstate down there. That's Air transport cool. 913 on the mist. Air transport 913, Roger. Uh, didn't get a chance to switch you to tower. Sorry about that. Uh, just uh, remain with me, and you're still under radar. Uh, XP mist approach is published. Thanks. Intentions. As published, we'll update you in a moment. Air transport 913. Six Delta Mike, runway one seven left, clear for the option. One seven left, clear for the option. Seven one six Delta Mike. We'll probably go ahead and go full stop this time by. Roger. Uh, wind three three zero at three. Roger that. Southwest twenty eighty four. Uh, the airport is just passing off your nine o'clock five and a half miles. You have it inside. It's behind you. Inside twenty eighty four. So that's 184, clear for approach, runway one, correction, runway three, five left, establish final contact tower. Clear for the visual three, five left on uh, final contact tower, southwest 184. 
Missoula Ground, November 390, Delta Alpha Ray, taxi with X-ray. For 390, Delta Alpha, runway 12, taxi via Delta, Foxtrot, Alpha. Delta, Foxtrot, Alpha to 12 for 390, Delta Alpha. Numbers, power. Hold the nose up. There's the wide arc. We'll bring in our first notch of flaps. We'll go ahead and turn our base. Your transport 913, are you able uh, vectors on approach for uh, the Arnav runway 31 full stop? It's clear. Hazula? I'm sorry, the uh, VOR runway 31 at Amarillo Air Transport 913. Transport 930, yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. Maintain 5,000, and uh, you want to go ahead and pick up factors now, or you uh, do a couple more hold, uh, laps in the hold? No, we're ready. Uh, we'll maintain 5,000, and uh, we're ready for the approach of Transport 913. Uh, Air Transport 913, uh, fly heading 080, uh, vector VR, runway 31 approach. You can expect to join outside of style. Heading 0805000, Air Transport 913 for the uh, VR 31. And Missoula Ground, November 390, Delta Alpha. We're actually at the hangars. We'd like to cross 26 at Charlie and then go Delta Alpha 3, Alpha. For 390 Delta Alpha, uh, cross runway 26 at Charlie. And you can taxi via Delta, Foxtrot Alpha. Hold short runway 26 at Delta. Cross 26 at Charlie, uh, Delta Alpha, hold short at 26, 390 Delta Alpha. Air Transport 913, turn right heading 280. Right 280, Transport 913. Air Lima Delta, contact Flagstaff Tower. Tower 310 Lima Delta. For 6 Alpha Zulu, uh, confirm we do have Oscar, I'm going to miss that, and report to on our reporting site. Uh, zero 06 Alpha Zulu, 4.8 miles uh, from the airport. Airport's in sight, I do have Oscar, zero 06 Alpha Zulu. Zero 06 Alpha Zulu, contact Tucson Tower. Tucson Tower, zero 06 Alpha Zulu. Centennial Tower, Cessna 716 Delta Mike, clear at runway 17 left at A8, looking to taxi back to Alpha Rail. For 6 Delta Mike, taxi to Parking Eight Alpha and have a wonderful evening. Taxi via Alpha, you have a wonderful evening as well. Thank you, ma'am. For 310 Lima Delta, Flagstaff Tower, runway 21, quarter line 1, calm. Runway 21, quarter line 310 Lima Delta. Denver Tower, South West 28, or 10 mile final, visual runway 35 left. What can I tell you? If you deal with air traffic control in the right way, they are very friendly people. Tucson Tower is Cessna 106 Alpha Zulu, currently uh, at flight level 3400, I mean, excuse me, 3400, looking to land at 15 right. Southwest 2084, Denver Tower, runway 35 left, clear to land. Clear to land, runway 35 left, Southwest 2084. 
Air Transport 913, you're seven and a half miles from Stiles. Uh, maintain 5,000 until established. Oh, uh, correction, final approach course. Cleared VOR, runway 31 approach. Go ahead and get off here. 5,000 until established on the final approach course. Clear for the VOR, runway 31, Air Transport 913. And our 106 off of Zulu, Tucson Tower, make straight in, runway 11 left, quick land. Make straight in, one, runway 11 left, uh, 06 off of Zulu, thanks. For 0 Delta, off across runway 26 at Delta. Cross 26 at Delta, 390 uh, Delta Alpha. And someone else was calling with request for agent. Transport 913 at Skies, contact Amarillo Tower. Skies Tower, Transport 913. Hold the mixture. See what we can do here. Let's take a look real quick. Or flight. And there's our pattern tonight. I'm not sure how many laps we turned in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe nine or ten uh, laps in the pattern. Um, some consistency, a couple inconsistent in on the early ones there. Um, but tonight was more just about getting Pilot Edge to work again with Microsoft Flight Sim for me. It was the first time I've been able to use uh, Pilot Edge in uh, Microsoft Flight Sim. Um, I had used it a lot in X-Plane before and had not done anything with recording and OBS uh, prior to now, so just wanted to to see if we get this working but uh thanks for watching and uh hopefully i can make more of these and we're going to look into doing a little live streaming next so stay tuned thanks and have a good evening